if you're a litigant in person, you're in a place that we hope you'll find useful. Uh, something we've noticed is that litigants in person often try to go it alone. They're in person, but they're alone. Litigants in person can help each other. You have information that others will need and benefit from, and there are things you need that others already have that if only they knew you needed it, they'd be happy to give it. We've designed this program in a fashion that will allow you to ask the questions you need addressed and to address the questions that other litigants in person have asked. Before you start this thing, you have no idea of what you're getting yourself into. You have to learn. You have to be prepared to make this a full-time job. Learning about the protocols of the case. Learning about the protocols of the court. Learning when to stand up for the judge. Learning when to sit down. Learning when to shut up is an important part of it. You really have to ask yourself, do I really want to do this? Also, you have to be prepared to work extremely hard at it. The court appearances are the high points. All the work that needs to be done in between makes it really time consuming. It is probably easier now to get all the knowledge you need from the internet but then you'll probably be getting it in a foreign language. You need to get somebody to walk you through so that you can understand what it actually means in your real world, which is not the real world that you're about to go into. The other aspect you need to take on board is what will this do to my health? Not only my health, but the health of the people around me. You can't do it without support. And supporting you and suffering with you, your knockbacks, and you will get them, affects not only your health, but the health of the people around you. Please go into this with your eyes wide open. Right? One of the things uh, Jeff just said was that the language will be foreign. At first pass it won't appear foreign, necessarily, because it will be English using English words. The difference is that they have very, very special meanings which you may or may not recognize in advance. So you could be thinking you're communicating one thing and actually be communicating something quite different and vice versa. This is one of the reasons that speaking with other litigants in person can have real value for you. Something else Jeff said is that the internet is a great place to find information. One of the hopes we have for this site, and it's certainly our intention, is to enable people who have professional level knowledge and professional level services that may be of use to you to provide that through this program in some fashion. So if you see what you want, great, let us know that you've got it. If you don't see what you want and what you need, tell us and we'll see if we can find a way to get it to you. If you are a professional who has knowledge and services that litigants in person might really benefit from, contact us because we'd like to figure out a way to enable you to use this induction program to reach out and help the litigants in person.